Oh, what's up, YouTube? How's it going? I'm back again for another random schmandom tandem video. Today, I'll be talking to you guys about the difference between Bumble and Tinder. For all you single men out there, I'm about to fucking give it to you. Lay it low, give you the tips and tricks, give you the secrets. What's the difference? Let's get started. First, I'm going to light this cigar before we go any further. Woo! Got all the reburns. <laughs> Anyways. All right, so... <clears throat> The difference with Bumble and Tinder. So you're a single dude, you don't have a wife, you don't have two side chicks looking for threesomes and stuff. The Don Carleone cigar. You basically want to date. Okay? So with Tinder, I had about 50, 60 matches. And what I do, and a lot of guys do this, if you ever watched on YouTube, is they use up all their swipes. This is not paying for it. I'm not, I've never once paid for it. Never once paid for Tinder, never once paid for Bumble. None of that shit. POF, whatever. And what I did was, I used up all my swipes. See who I match with. Because you know what? The ones you do like that are super hot, they're never going to match with you. And you'd be surprised not taking looks into consideration going on dates with chicks that aren't as good looking. They're very nice, humble, well put together people. So putting looks aside, use up all your swipes. Build up a conversation with both Bumble, Tinder people. So the thing with Tinder is I had like 50, 60 matches. Not one chick messaged me. Not one. Me. Six foot two, 270 pounds. I ain't no small fry. I ain't fucking ugly. At least I don't think so. I'm probably getting up there. I'm 34 now. <laughs> but um, the thing with Bumble is that they have to match with you as well and they have to message you first so chicks on bumble have the upper hand they swipe on a dude the dude can't match or sorry the dude can't message her she has to message him so right away it's genuine burning desire anyone that watches videos on relationships in the manosphere or manoswamp swamp as they call it Red pill, blue pill, whatever pill you fucking are, black pill. Um, you want the woman to have the genuine burning desire in you. Because if a chick digs you, she will chase you, she'll go after you, she will be everything for you. On Tinder, they're Tinderellas, they're Tinder hoes, they want you to message them, they want to be chased. And you know what? When you've talked to as many chicks as me, it gets old really fucking fast. So you want to be on Bumble. Now, you get less matches on Bumble, but you get more conversations, more messages, all that crap than you do on Tinder. And that's just what I've noticed in the last, I don't know, almost four years I've been doing it. So you talk to a chick you have a nice conversation. You know, you hit it off good. I find the chicks on Tinder are attention whores. They have their Instagram on there. On Bumble, it's different. I find the girls are more genuine. They're more down to earth. They're more compliant. They're more like uh, take you home to meet your parents kind of girls. Um... Now, I'm, I'm talking about this up here in Canada. 
I was told a lot of guys think Canadian chicks are hot. They are hot, but there's a lot of fucking foreigners up here too. So, you know, if you're not into bigger girls or East Indian or Asian or whatever your type may be, you might not want to play my game of swiping on everybody and use up all your likes. But if you play my game, you might have a better success rate. Now, it might be different if you pay for it. I've never actually paid for these websites, like I said at the start of the video. But it could be different if you do pay for it. You, you can swipe all the time. You can change your location. Like, say you're in... Excuse me. Say you're in Toronto. You're going to Vancouver for the week. You can, If you pay for it, you can change your location to go to Vancouver a week before you even get there. And the, another cool thing is if you're a truck driver like me or you travel, you, you're picking up matches all along the highway, freeway, which is sweet. And then you get a lot of chicks all bummed out. They're like, oh, you're like 200 kilometers away. Oh. Or if you're partying in a town that you've never partied in before, you match with a lot of chicks because they're like, ooh, fresh meat, someone new. And that is totally true. I don't care what anyone says. Um you definitely get hit on more and gawked at, picked up more, more matches. But if you're from the same town and the, the shady thing with Tinder is that people that pay for it, you could tell they're always at the top of the list and you see the same old fucking sketchy chicks always at the top of the list. Like nobody wants them or they're super picky. They're just picking through the run to the litter they want their one guy that's waiting for him to be made by God or somebody. <clears throat> These chicks need to get the fuck over themselves. Um, but that's my opinion on uh, Tinder versus Bumble. I choose Bumble for sure. There's more conversations. Uh, Tinder's just shady and all these chicks are full of themselves. Plus with Bumble, you can like take a picture of yourself, which is cool. And you can zoom in on their picture as well. You can't do that on Tinder. Unless you screen snap and zoom in. But how would I know that? <laughs> it's just over the years of doing it. You used to get 40 swipes. <laughs> you used to get like 40 swipes on Tinder or something like that. And Bumble. They are in competition with each other. But... Clearly, the more classy, successful women definitely branch off to Bumble. People that have their shit together, gentlemen, go on Bumble. Don't use Tinder. Tinder's for, like, I'm in my 20s and I want to get laid. Um, you can land yourself a sugar mama, an older woman. Um, you'd be surprised what you can get using Bumble over Tinder. I do not recommend using Tinder for anything but a hookup site. If you want to actually genuinely meet someone, Bumble and other websites, Matchmaker, you have to pay for, probably the best, but I ain't paying for that crap. I'm not at that part in my life where I need to pay to get laid or pay to have a girlfriend. That's just stupid. So take my recommendations, take my advice, leave your comments down below, Bumble over Tinder any day of the week. Thanks so much for watching. Please like and subscribe for more random videos. So try to upload not so often, and I'll talk to you real soon. Bye for now.